Hey everyone, um, there's this little something I want to share with you guys today. Um, I just discovered this a couple hours ago. Um, this is Rigs of Rod, no, Rigs of Rods, um, uh, slightly difficult to pronounce, um, which is a soft physics simulation software. And also, I think Rigs of Rods is a, a development team who is working on this. So, what they are, I guess, concentrating right now is. Uh, vehicle um, soft physics um, so if you hate um, Ford 1949 as much as I do uh, let's try and destroy this car and see what they have achieved so far this technology is supposed to as I understand be part of um, cry, was it CryEngine 3 um, but probably will make its way into um, other um, um, games, not games, engines, and I guess games. Um, but yeah, let me just demonstrate what it does. So, in this particular software package, you can just obviously just drive the car around. Um, and let's try and get some speed and then crash into something. It's actually not very easy to drive this around. I have this on um, full uh, automatic gear to so crash into this building. Okay, let's drive away a little bit so I can show you the damage. And it's really, really cool. Um, may not be apparent from this angle, but let's get closer. See? Okay. Well, maybe that's not, again, very... Um, I think it's still pretty cool, but not probably not very telling of what this is capable of. Um, if you get bored of driving around, also, so... The game, this is not really a game, this program is free, you can just download it. And um, it comes also with loads of skins and vehicles that you could control. I'm just trying to, the camera is a bit clunky. Um, and you can drive around, fly around and, and um, um, sail around in. Um, but if you get bored of this sort of destruction uh, where you're actually controlling the vehicle, you can always do this. And this, I guess, more closely demonstrates the the very, very cool um, soft physics engine they have created. I guess that that would be the appropriate name for it. Um, like literally everything in the car is um, can be deformed or destroyed, uh, and this is potentially a very, very nice um, destruct damage. Uh, engine or whatever it is called in in the professional circles of programmers uh, for some driving games like for example the next um, version of GTA or such observe let's ah, it's flying for too long let's bring it down um, the cool thing is you can still drive this around <laughs> well kinda Alright, let's get a different car, so I can show you some other vehicles. There's like loads and loads of them that the people just created. Someone was there um, mentioning that, oh, I've spent nine months on creating this helicopter, um, which I actually have here, right, let me, see. let me get the helicopter. I don't really know how to fly it because um, it's a bit complicated and it says like, oh, pre click this and this to start, but it just doesn't start. Um, helicopter, there you go, the Sky Crane. Uh, okay, bring it in. Looks pretty cool. Uh, and I wish I could fly it, but I, I can't really fly it. It says uh, somewhere here on the bottom, it says click on buttons, but I, they're un really unclickable, so I don't know what it means. But um, we can also uh, destroy this beautiful thing. Wait, come on. Why is this not working? Oh, there we go. Stall warning. Stall warning. Probably is a bit of an annoying stall warning, but stall warning. Okay, admittedly cars are a bit more fun to destroy. Let's get another car. Oh, this is your small avatar that you control within. Oh, come on, within this world. Um, let's get something newer. Uh, and there's also lots of terrains that you can download and um, drive in or 
whatever, move around in. And this also comes with a multiplayer uh, option where I guess you can just race, crash each other, whatever online. You can host the server as well. Um, so what am I doing? I'm getting uh, street cars, really? Is this? Yeah, okay, let's get this, whatever this is, for example. Cool. Um, oh yeah, so you can also go into manual gear if, if you so desire. If you change the gear with uh, page up, page down. I've only been playing the w around with this for like half an hour. I think I already destroyed the wheels. Um, and I've seen some very nice footage made by, um, or at least displayed by, um, what's the name? Jesus Christ. Um, rock, paper, shotgun. That's why I couldn't remember what they're called. Anyway, and um, this is, is not really like that footage, which I will link in the description, um, but it's still really cool. Okay, so, um, yeah, I, mean, I, I destroyed it a bit prematurely. Let's continue with that. Also, you can just grab, uh, for example, the hood here and just rip it out, I think. Wait, just hood. Ah, uh, come on. <laughs> it's still attached. Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, turn around. Stop. Open the door. No, the door. Uh, it's still attached. I can take this away. Take the trunk away. There we go. And as I understand, you can also like you do your own battles if you're into such thing. And um, it is a lot of fun and potentially very very uh, realistic physics engine thing, which I wanted to show you today. So thanks for watching that, and um, I'll see you around. Bye.